Let's download the Unreal plugin and DAZ's control rig from Dollar's mocap website. After downloading, unzip the files. Next, let's create a new Unreal project and copy the unzipped directory into the project's content folder. In the DAZ directory, you can find four animation blueprints and four control rigs. The choice depends on whether the fix bone and zero root options in the DAZ to Unreal settings are checked. If both are checked, select the animation blueprint and control rig with fix bone zero root in their names. If neither is checked, choose the animation blueprint and control rig without these terms in their names. If only one is checked, then select the animation blueprint and control rig with fix bone or zero root as applicable. The plugin defaults to these options being checked, so let's check both for now. Then let's import a character from DAZ. After importing the character, first click on the fix bone zero root animation blueprint. A dialog box asking to select a skeleton will pop up, choose the skeleton we just imported. Now, let's create a new character blueprint, choosing $MOCAPACTOR as the parent class. Add the skeletal mesh to the blueprint and set the animation class to Fixbone Zero Root Animation Blueprint. You will see the character in T-Pose. Add the character blueprint to the scene, then add a dollars receiver. In the character blueprint, select the receiver in the scene. Let's run the dollars program, and you can see the character is correctly animated.